Hey, what is up guys? It is Mike here and I got some more interesting stuff to cover uh, for Five Nights at Freddy's. So if you go on Reddit and you go on the Five Nights at Freddy's subreddit and you uh, look at the little uh, black picture on the right that says offline and you take it and you brighten it up by a lot, you will see that it has some secret messages. And you might say, but Smike, this was posted as a reaction uh, to Scott's update on his website. Well, here's the twist. This image was uploaded one day before anyone found out about the 30 years later and only one left tags. And only the subreddit moderators can modify this image. So that means that Scott Cawthon must have gotten into contact with the moderators and asked them to post this picture and not tell anybody. But yeah, so there's nothing really new about the three nor about the 30 nights later and only one left tags. But one thing that's pretty interesting is if you look at the bottom right, there is a shadowy mysterious figure. So who is this you may ask? Well, I have an idea. I mean, look at its size and its black body. Does it remind you of anything? For example, oh, I don't know, Shadow Bonnie? Could this be Shadow Bonnie? Could Shadow Bonnie be the only one left? And so maybe Shadow Bonnie could be uh, the one and only antagonist in Five Nights at Freddy's 3. I don't know, you guys tell me what you think, because I think this makes sense, because Shadow Bonnie was put in the second game without any uh, official purpose, so maybe Scott put it there uh, as a foreshadowing. But anyway guys, thanks for watching my video, as usual, if you want to see more Freddy's videos, news, and top 10s, subscribe to my channel, you will not regret it, and otherwise, I'll see you guys next time, peace!